Good kitten internet. I'm currently in a park and it's night, so it's kind of dark and quiet. I've not really been having a very good week or year for that matter. Um, uh, my depression's been, or I should say my depression plus multiple anxieties have been kind of off the charts lately. So, <sighs> it's, yeah. Um, part of the reason why this is going to be a very short vlog is because I've basically already recorded. Namely, I was streaming on Twitch for about two and a half hours trying to go through one mission in XCOM 2. Very long mission, but it was still one mission. Uh, and I kind of count that kind of like vlogging. So, yeah, you're not going to get much of a vlog today. Let me move indoors where there's light because I can't imagine this looks very good. Meow. 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 That twitchy tail. No. No. Hi, Sam Kinney. I'm glad to see you greeting me when I get home. So thank you. I'm back. So, um, something I feel like talking about today. Um, I'm sure several of you are aware of something called Spoon Theory. Uh, for those of you that aren't, Spoon Theory is effectively you have n number of spoons in a given day, and your mental health conditions, various physical ailments, and so on, can increase or decrease the number of spoons that you have available that day. On top of it, various things cost spoons, so... For an example, for one person, taking a shower might cost one spoon. Um, for other people, it might cost seven spoons. For other people, it might give you back a spoon, and you get the idea. It's different for different people, and even different based off of each day. Yeah. Hi, Zoe. Uh, I, myself, don't really quite fit into spoon theory. Uh... It doesn't quite match my existence, but it's a good way of describing things, because at least that's a way that some people recognize. Uh, so, taking off this jacket, because it's kind of warm. Yes, so I know it's late. So, um... Where was I? So, my version of Spoon Theory works a little differently. Or not like my version of the theory. Ah, yes. Yes, um, I know. Um, my, I guess you would say my experience with spoons works a bit differently. So most people, the way it works is basically they have a number of spoons. They spend it throughout the day. If they run out, well, they're basically done for the day. I don't quite work that way. The way I end up working is that I spend today's, tomorrow's, and the day after spoons. Uh, so, if I run out of spoons for the day, I'm usually okay. I'm just spending the next day's spoons, which means that I'm quite a bit more depleted each subsequent day. Till eventually I get so deep into spoon debt, I'm basically useless. And as I found out a couple weeks ago, I have my immune system crash and... Basically, I get sick. Um, it happens quite often for me. Not just the getting sick part, but going into spoon debt in general. What are you doing, kitty? Are you just gargoyling again? Probably. So, um, I mean... If you look at my life logically, it's a fairly decent life. I mean, I'm a white male. I have money. I have a stable job. I have kitties that love me, like this one right here, who just walked away naturally. Um, I have a partner. Specifically speaking, life should be pretty good for me, but I suffer very heavily from depression and multiple anxiety disorders and physical ailments and all of those fun things. Chronic pain, for that matter. Uh, 
these things tend to wear me down. So to use that spoon theory I described earlier, basically for the past month I've been in spoon debt. I just kind of can't even, to borrow a Tumblrism. I... You'll notice that I actually have my voice back and seems to be mostly staying back. That's because I basically took yesterday and today to do nothing but recover spoons. Outside of my daily visit down to the nearby Pokestop, because I'm a Pokemon, book, ah, Pokemon Go player, I have not left the house this weekend. At all. Luckily, I kind of planned for this, so I did a very large online grocery shopping trip. Uh, would have been January. So I actually have a fairly large amount of food in the house. And today I actually felt up to cooking for the first time in two weeks. <laughs> um, so I actually have food for the week. That's nice. Um, yeah. So I'm not doing well. I pretend that I'm doing quite a bit better than I really am. It's the whole fake it until you make it type of thing. Except in my case it's fake it until you have your immune system crash out on you and you get sick. So, that, that's great. Um, so, I apologize if I'm not responding to things much or not being as happy as normal. It's hard for me to fake being that happy if I'm that far down. Wow. This just looks white. That's what I get for living in Wisconsin. No sun whatsoever. He seems unhappy. I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. Um... Have a nice day, Internet. I will see you some other time, and I'm going to try to um, actually publish the video streams that I have for XCOM 2. I actually have had them transferred to YouTube for a while now, just I didn't want to flood people with them. So don't be too surprised if you see that I have more videos coming up. I'm just not linking them on uh, Facebook. I'll... I'll probably link him on Twitter just because there's enough stuff there. Good night.